what's up guys thank you for coming back to my channel again uh i'm lisa obviously always have been always will be is anybody else watching the olympics right now man it's just so inspiring to uh to see all these people absolutely smashing their sports i absolutely love the olympics but i'm a bit gutted because i've kind of only just got into it and it's been going on for like a week it ends in like three days i think but hey ho that's my problem weather in the uk absolutely sucks right now absolutely sucks this is supposed to be our summer and it's raining it just absolutely sucks but i've been waiting for this order to come since uh the order time was between five past nine and five past twelve it is now quarter to four it's quarter to four but it's just come and I haven't opened it yet, so I'm going to do it with you guys, a proper unboxing. Um, let me see if I can turn the So I've torn away my dress. So here you go, you get 10% off for a friend. Use friends, I think that's friends10, I will confirm it. Poundtoy.com. Still sealed. There's my trusty weapon of choice. What we're going to do is open it and get it looked at. Let's just edit that. So how is everybody doing? Had some lovely, lovely people commenting on my videos. You guys are so sweet. It seems like I have the absolute best subscribers. Um, I think it's exclusively a water drop community that I have, which is fine. But obviously, I don't just buy water drop goods. I buy loads and loads of goods. Um, I treat my girlfriend. I treat me. I treat my daughter. Let's take a little pew. Pew, not poo. I am actually... Um, I am actually off sick today. Uh, I had a very bad IBS episode yesterday. And if you suffer with IBS, you will know exactly what I'm talking about. Um, it left me a little bit debilitated yesterday and just not at all ready to get up at half one this morning for work. So I uh, feel a little bit better today. So probably go back to work tomorrow to start at 4 a.m. But like I've said, I have a new job. I am very, very excited to get started. Um, it's at a sort of restaurant in uh, my local area. Um, it'll be exactly the same money, so no money deductions for me, um, but better hours so that I get to see my daughter more, get more sort of free time, don't have to do these ridiculous three o'clock in the morning starts, which I cannot deal with anymore. Um, it's safe to say that these 3 a.m. starts are definitely a con contributing factor to uh, my IBS and definitely doesn't make it better. Uh, if anything, I think it makes it worse. So um, I had to look for a new job for my health, basically, um, just to stay healthy and just to stay well, because that is, let's face it, the most important thing at the end of the day. So let's take a gander at what we've got. So I actually bought a couple of things for my daughter and we're gonna wrap them up for Christmas because, you know, why the hell not? We don't have that long, right? Um, and she is massively into a Lego at the moment, and I'm gonna take I'm gonna take some slack for that. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with Lego. Um, so this one is um, it's kind of like Lego. It's not gonna be Lego. They're called Block Tech. Um, as you can see there, the difficulty rating is one out of five. So it's gonna be quite easy for her age, a six plus, which is fine. She's almost like a ten year old anyway. Um, and this is excuse me construction crew this is like some sort of digger so we're going to wrap that up this is emergency rescue uh, i think this is a helicopter that's right it is oh it's level two why does it have two it has two on the back but one on the front interesting um so we have a lovely helicopter for her to build two and a tractor right there these all look really cool, quite fun, little projects for her to get involved in, and then when she absolutely smashes it, we can put it up on display in her bedroom. So there they are, all three of them, uh, made by Block Tech. These were something like, by the time you've taken one of their 50% deals off, I think these were like £1.50 a box. So you can't really go wrong with that, especially as um, it's going to be put away for Christmas. Let's pop them on the floor. Uh, what else have we This one's for my girlfriend, just because I'm a right old smoothie. It's a hatching egg, and it's Minnie Mouse. Um, so you add it to water, you leave it for 24 to 48 hours. After 72 hours, the egg will crack, 
and up to eight days later Minnie will grow to full size I'm not quite sure what that full size is full size could be my size full size could be any size um but she loves Disney and again by the time you've taken away a massive discount that I had it came to like a quid so what's a quid right marble madness marble man marble mountain so uh drop it and race the mountains twist turns and crazy tubes right here so we build the tubes you pop your marbles in and then you see who wins i guess i guess it's it's a game 35 track pieces 15 marbles instructions 50 piece set definitely states there it's a kid's game but i'm still a kid um this is this is so fun and i think it was eight pound and then by the time with my discount it was down to four pound so again I don't know if we're going to keep this for like right now or if I'm going to do this as a Christmas present. I haven't quite decided yet. Um, but yeah, excited to get into that one. Number cards. Peppa Pig number cards. This girl is crazy on Peppa Pig, especially after we've been to Paulton's Park. She is um, a bit crazy on the old girl. Uh, but now these are, yeah, num um, they're flashcards. So, um you can say like what is that it's obviously an aeroplane so it begins with the letter a and then um here's there you go she started school in september um if you didn't know i had I have a four and a half year old from my marriage um she's gorgeous and i have every faith in her that she's gonna absolutely nail school even though she's a bit nervous but I think it helps starting a new job because I can explain to her, mummy starting a job is a bit like you starting school. Um, mummy's nervous, you're going to be nervous, but after a couple of weeks we're going to make new friends, we're going to know what we're doing, we're going to know the layout of the school slash job, and we're just going to go and we're going to grab it with both hands, we're going to enjoy the experience, and then we can talk about it later. Uh, I don't think we've seen cars. This is like some bop thing, so you blow it up and then you just punch it and it springs back to the middle um just looks like fun and uh yeah just not for christmas just for now because why the hell not when our, fi our summer finally does hit i think we had like a week of it of a heat wave and then we've just had this since so when it does hit us again i think we are due another heat wave i bought some water balloons they are self-sealing um oh it's called absorb they called water balloons when I was growing up. Um, and they're self-sealing, yeah. After filling, remove Zorb and gently pinch the neck. Hold Zorb upright and release neck, allowing balloon to seal instantly. There you go. Self-tie water balloons. You get 75 in there. Again, by the time you've had your reduction in price, it's, it's like a pound. I can't even remember. They don't give you, um... They don't give you an invoice. What is this? This is for my daughter, Ocean Eggs. Same thing as the mini, you drop it in water, you wait a couple of days, and you uh, you wait and see what animal you get. She could get anything. I think she could get a killer whale, dolphin, a starfish, Nemo. Not quite sure. It looked like cool. Alright, don't judge me. Uh, high glossy photo paper. You know, this, this shop sells absolutely everything you need and everything you absolutely don't need. Um, but we are starting to mess around with our photos and our printers a bit more. So this is a little gift for my girlfriend so we can print our own pictures off and stick them around this lovely flat that we have. Again, like a quid. The whole thing came to £24, I believe, so definitely can't complain. 3D explosion. Draw and watch the characters come to life. So this is like, um, I don't actually know what you do with this. I think you colour it in or you draw or something and then you put 3D glasses on and then it just kind of pops out at you. That's something that me and the kiddo can do together. Tabletop golf. It's so cute. This is for my dad as a cheeky little uh, Christmas present. Um, but I am way too uh, inquisitive of a person to wait that long. So I'm going to have a look at it right now. Because they had tabletop basketball, they had tabletop golf, they had tabletop... Anything you could do on a tabletop, they had it in a miniature version. So, if it's good, I can get myself a little something something. Oh, it's cute. It's very cute. Can I open it without it look like I can? So, 
talk amongst yourselves for a minute. <laughs> How's everybody doing? Is everybody hitting up the new water drop sale? Remember you use Vibe Hype and you get 15% off your bill and you can use it as many times as you like uh, until August the 8th. So you've got some time left but not long. So if you want to get on it. This is very, very cute. I'm assuming you put the flags in the holes. That's why you've got holes, right? And then, here's your little diddy tiny golf balls. That's a bit cute. And here's your club. If you know somebody that is into their golf, um, you can get this, I think. I don't quite know what to do. I guess you do that. And then you put the ball there. No, that's not going to work. Oh, I see. That goes in there like that. And then, oh, you flick it. So, let me tell you. So this is what it looks like. Very, very cute. So you put the ball in there. And then you flick it. Very good. It's going to be very, very hard and fiddly. Merry Christmas, Dad. So, um, that's for him. And that just, just a little bit of fun, you know, a little stocking filler for him. Bless him. Um, and now that I've seen that, though, I'm 100% getting me the uh, tabletop basketball. Because, uh, you know, you used to play in my uh, heyday as a teenager. I used to play uh, basketball for my school at a relatively high level. Lots of tournament centred and things like that. I played football for Crawley Town. Girls, obviously. Um, was pretty okay at that too. Um, just generally a sporty lass, but never tried golf. But anyway, there you go, there's that. Uh, what else did we get? We got uh, the little girl, a Paw Patrol flannel. What she does is she puts the flannel over her eyes when you shampoo her hair because she is phobic of any kind of water or shampoo or conditioner or anything getting in her eyes. So we already have a frozen flannel, now we have a Paw Patrol flannel, which means we can clean the frozen one and we still have a leftover one. Again, like 50p, it's actually really nice, it's actually really soft. So she should be happy with that. Uh, civil aircraft top trumps, just because I was feeling a little bit geeky and I never ever order myself anything from this store. I always get stuff for other people, as you've seen. But do you know what? We do like a game of top trumps in this house. And uh, it gets quite competitive. When we went to Disneyland, me and my girlfriend played um, every night. And I won most, if not all, of the games. So, you know, come at me with your top trumps and, uh, and I'll play you. So you've got an Airbus. Concord. Oh, Concord's got to be good, no? Concord is banging. Airbus. Airbus? Airbus still flies. You need stuff that's like Cessna. Some of these are banging. Airbus A300. Holy crap, there's some planes on here that I've never even heard of. None of them are easy jet though. Funny that, isn't it? Bombardier. I know a certain dispatcher that would like these. However, he does not watch my vlogs, so go swivel. Um, there you go. Aircraft top tomps. Anybody want to play me? Holler at me and we'll have a go. It's about choosing the right number on the card at the right time. So you always feel like the highest number would be the winner, but you never know what card the other person has. So if you play something that's a bit more obscure, you've got more chance of winning that hand. There you go. Now, I've seen these poppy things absolutely everywhere. Um, didn't understand it until I started popping one for myself in a shop. And now I'm a little bit obsessed. Although this is not for me, this is for my daughter. Yeah, right. That is just, just, it's just really kind of nice and you can just sort of sit and pop. Oh dear. But yeah, like I said, for my daughter. So it was a penny. That was a penny. Um, every month or every week, these guys put new deals up on their website that are a penny. 
So you can get four things for 4p. I mean, they're not always the best things, as you've seen. This is like a little popping octopus, but it's a penny. So if you're going to do a, um, a massive order like me and buy loads of stuff, you might as well just get the four gifts for a penny. And even if you don't play with them, you can toss them or gift them and it ain't cost you nothing. What else do we get? They always throw in these crappy jelly babies. They're horrible. So if anybody wants them, you can have them. Um, bless them. It's very cute, but uh, there's no need. What else have you got? I paid for these jumpstick squashies. Absolutely amazing. Sour cherry and apple flavour. See, they sell sweets. They sell sweets. They're a toy shop and they sell sweets. What else have we got? An inflatable light stick. Again, this was a penny. Um, I didn't know how it worked, but you unfold the item, break the bubble stick inside and watch it inflate. For the child, she can have that. Uh, what else do we get? An Easter break Kit Kat. There you go. 12 to 1. It's in date. Uh, paid for this as well. It wasn't a gift. Um, bought the two sweets basically because if I didn't order over £25 worth of stuff, I would have to pay three ninety nine shipping. And I will always try and get free shipping because you can pay... You can pay for something with that money you would pay for shipping. So I always try and get free shipping. So... Um, I got the I got something like by the time you've deducted everything I think I paid something like £25 21p or something like that purely because this was like 50p and these were like 30p so still got something for nothing basically and then the last thing I saw this game that's it, that's the whole box I saw this game and I, I just, it sounded so much fun so it's called Ultimate Ninja Chopstick uh, Challenge. And you have to use the chopsticks to collect jewels and beads before the timer runs out. So up in this corner here you can see the jewels and the beads. Um, I think you get some little bowl type thing and you get your chopsticks. And the bowl wobbles when you touch it. So you have to be really specific with your chopsticks and get as many jewels as you can. Um, it just looks really really hard but I am so down for it uh, this will probably be actually we'll probably just give this to her um, because this would be really fun to play with Nanny and Grandad um, so maybe do that before Christmas but the other stuff um, the other stuff like the building bricks and stuff she can have for Christmas so yeah again that was like £8 down to £4 so all this stuff, absolute steal, a couple of Christmas presents sorted, little bits of things for her to do while she's currently off from nursery and heading to school in September. Um, so it's going to be a big change for all of us, but no doubt, I think she's going to love it, I think she's going to smash it. Um, and I'll obviously be here if she feels like she's not, which would be really, really heartbreaking. But um, yeah, I've been wanting to make that video since I ordered all that stuff, so there you have it. There's about £25 worth of stuff. Um, toys, paper, sweets, everything um, for different people. And uh, they always deliver really, really quickly. I think I ordered, so what day is it today? Day, today is Friday, and I think I ordered it on Tuesday, but it was 1 in the morning, so it was Wednesday morning. So it's taken less than two days to get here. So I'm very impressed. Have a little look at their website, see if they do shipping to your country because it's absolutely worth doing. Um, usually there is some sort of 50% off code at the moment, it's buy one toy, get one free. I don't know quite what the stipulations are, if that's everything that I've bought, if that's like buy one board game, get one free. There's probably like a whole menu that you get to choose from, it probably doesn't mean everything on the website is buy one, get one free. Take a look anyway, there is always something to be had for a penny. So, um, as you've seen, it was the elephant... The elephant, the octopus, oh my god, definitely need more sleep, and the uh, inflatable uh, torch glow stick thing that um, Amelia can have. So those two were a penny, so 2p for those two things, and it will keep her occupied, and no doubt this octopus will go everywhere with her because that's what she's like at the moment. Um, everything, nothing here was more than £5. So the top chopped card was a pound, the hatching egg was like £2.50, the pepper pig cards was down to 50p. So if your child is quite young um, and needing help with their alphabet and their letters and their numbers and stuff like that, this is perfect. Um, my daughter's struggling a little bit with her numbers rather than her letters. She seemed to learn her alphabet super duper quickly. But um, 
her numbers, especially the writing of them, is uh, we're going backwards a little bit, so we need to try and bring her up to speed with her numbers. Aside from that, she is amazing. She's the best girl ever. I am so, so blessed to be her mum. So yeah, aside from that, everything else is awesome and I'm very happy with the purchases and I'll probably go and get a load more stuff because this is my third or fourth uh, pound toy shop order. So check out the other videos, see what else I got. There is stuff that we still use today, stuff that we haven't even looked at or opened yet, but it's there, ready to keep her occupied as and when she needs it. Um, yeah, hope everybody's doing good. Hope everybody's doing well. Um, thank you so much for those of you that comment on my videos and that send love. Um, I'm super duper pleased that you guys uh, talk to me about my videos. Um, comment if there's anything you want to see me do. Um, I have a video in the pipeline involving a special guest, which would be my girlfriend. We have bought uh, a ton of different foods, managed to find so many different foods in our local supermarkets. Uh, and we want to do that so it's different foods from different countries basically um, in a nutshell so we're going to do that when I feel like I can eat a few bits of rubbish and it won't uh, mess me about which is not today unfortunately uh, but we will crack on with that very soon um, when I finish this video I'm going to shoot another one because we went to see Hairspray in London and I want to do a theatre review um, especially as it's back up and running since Covid closed it so I'm going to shoot that in a second, that's if you see the same onesie, that's because it's the same day and it will literally be five minutes later. So stay well, stay safe, keep talking to me, keep interacting, I absolutely love hearing from you guys. Um, there's 50 of you now, 50 subscribers is not a massive number to anybody, but to me it means the world. Uh, because you've grown so, so quickly. Um, at the beginning of the year I think I had 12 subscribers and now it's... Uh, it was end of July when I had 50 of you, so I am so chuffed that you've subscribed and liked and commented and all of that stuff. So please continue to do so if you know somebody that will like my videos or if you've got questions about water drop or vitiligo or IBS or underactive thyroid or toy shops or anything like that that I've reviewed, please get in touch because I love talking to you guys. And, um, and I will speak to you soon.